<laughs> lovely, lovely. Just tricked you there. That's got to be reviewed, especially on the time of the uh, party. And this is quite a good idea. Especially when I learned to. Oh, Jesus. Good afternoon, people. All right, um, still in holiday mode. <laughs> Gutted. Only got back and got stuck in passport control. Not even going to go into it. Anyway, this is what I'm here to do. Or we're here to do, rather. Hoppy oatmeal pale ale coming in at 5.4%. Two chefs brewing happy howling. Brewed exclusively for Beer Wolves' fifth anniversary. So that should be interesting. Ingredients, wool. Water, barley, wheat, hops, oats. That's the thing that I found was, I don't think I've ever had a oatmeal, oat, an oat pale ale before. I don't know if anyone has. I forgot to take the top out again because I'm an idiot. Got to keep me. <laughs> oh, oh pale You can't beat that, you know. Anyway. Enough about that, let's get this off. I know what's going to happen now. You know the score. You don't need me doing a lecture loading this up. It's just the main thing of doing this is to show you that the torps are tall. Because I could con it, couldn't I? And it could be anything. True? That's true. You would do that, wouldn't you? you no. Oh, Jesus. Push it down, get it in. And we know it's all ready. We know it's cold enough. We've had this out of the fridge. As you can see, the condensation is... Go in, yeah. it? So it's a bit warmer, which I'm sure would be. Shouldn't that make more noise? Don't play games with me. Don't they? <laughs> Did you hear that? Right. I don't know having some issues here today. <laughs> I can't get the staff out of Right. Oh my god. Right. That is not properly. Eh? That is not properly. Oh, what's wrong with it? There you go. See? Lovely jubbly, eh? Right. Because you know what's going to go wrong. Always do this. And then just. Is it? Mm. Okay. Right. Boom! 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 Make some strange old noises, that, isn't it? Yeah, but it's pouring all right, so. Pouring very slow, isn't it? Um. Um. Right, okay. We'll just do our off and away. Must just be a loading problem. It doesn't matter in a way. That will do. So there you go. Lovely and carbonated. Do you want to come and stay? Come in and see things. Oh, yes. just then. Right, so this is. It's quite a dark amber colour really, isn't it? Yeah, Lots wrote, of carbonation in there. I wrote something down, what um, they said on the website somewhere. Hold on a minute. So, right, um, getting to business. Comes from the Netherlands, as I'm sure I said already. 5.4% um, ABV, as I'm sure I said. And it's 15.99 for the top. Beer Wolves. Mm. Birthday, but if you think about it, they're giving us all £5 each in an email, so that will take £5 off your top. So it won't be quite... So expensive. Yeah, um, yeah, they said citrus, passion fruit, melon. Yeah, I'm getting the pas 
passion fruit and I'm getting quite a strong citrusy note there. I don't know about melon, but I'm not really good at picking up melon on smells. I don't think melon has a really predominant smell, so that will probably be on the taste. Yeah, it's just, I just thought they said about it. But it smells good, doesn't it? It does, it does smell very fruity. And it's a, it's, it, uh, it's got supposed to have a round mouthfeel and full because it's brewed using oats or something like that. Yeah, that is strange, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know. What do I know? Um, not a lot. Okay, let's give it a nice swirl. All the beer, no idea. See, just pour a half, mate. <laughs> you must follow Bazza. Anyone not following him? He's just gone off to do a black stout. No, a black IPA. A black IPA. Yeah. And I've gone off. I said, well, if you're doing one, I'm going to do one. So I've come out and done this. Yeah, right. Mm. Yeah, now that that is that is a good IPA. Um, yeah, that's got some go in it. That is lovely. It's smooth. I thought you said it was a pale ale. Oh yeah, it is a pale ale. Yeah, yeah I was going to say it doesn't taste like an IPA. It does have that rich kind of pale ale taste. Um, lovely and smooth. Lovely fruit flavours in there. Yeah, I'm really picking up the passion Lovely, fruit. Isn't it? The, the, yeah, it's that not really even, is nice. It's not even got the dodgy bite at this at the end. It was just smooth all the way through. That's yeah. a cracker, isn't it? Oi, shush. <laughs> I don't know. As I say, um, yeah. That's got some... And 5.4, they will flow down. Mm. I mean, I... I would say I've I've never had anything from was it two brewing or something they were called. Mm. I've, I know them from somewhere, but I'm not sure if we've had anything by them. But obviously, Netherlands produce some some good beer. And that is really nice. The flavours um, combine really well with each other, don't they? And it's totally what I read out what they said, isn't it? Yeah, it is. More like yeah, I'd say more so to the passion fruit. Yeah. That is absolutely lovely. Isn't it? That's up there. Beer pale I mean, we've had some good pale ales lately, haven't we? We have, As yeah. with some IPAs. I mean, I always call them each one, each one. <laughs> you like to correct me, didn't you? But that is, that is a very good pale ale. That's got some really nice fruity flavours in there. It's lovely and smooth, a nice rich mouthful. I, yeah, got, I like that. It's got that club thing to it without the bite. But it, what is wrong with that thing? I don't know. <laughs> I think it's got the... <laughs> yes, you know, but I think the sub's got the number two, so shush. Right, now shush. I'll have a look at that after the review, but when you're in the middle of it, you started, I will start, so I'll go home even when they do go home. But that's not take nothing away from the beer. That drink, yeah. Uh, this, this beer is very good. I mean, um, we've, we've done a few lately, some good, some bad, I must admit. But um, congratulations, by the way, Beer Wolf, if any of you yeah. watch this ever on five years. I read all the story about you both and absolutely brilliant. And that is absolutely brilliant. Yeah. I'm the first one to say if it's a dodgy talk, as I'm sure you know, <laughs> or if it's a great talk, I'll also praise it. That is one of the best I've had for ages. Yeah, that's very, very good. And it's a brilliant to release it for the, for the fifth birthday and everything, isn't it? Yeah. And even... You know, you, people are saying, well, it's it's fifteen ninety nine. you can get such and such for 8 99 but seriously. Yeah, like you said, you got your £5 back as well, didn't you? Yeah, so yeah you get, everyone's got a £5. £5 pound. Same, but seriously, even if you're paying £4 a pint, that's quality. It is very, very nice, yeah. You know, that's a proper, really yeah. nice power, isn't it? It's so smooth, all the way through. Carbonation is absolutely excellent. And brilliant on the mouthfeel. Yeah. And um, it's almost velvety, isn't it? It's yeah. So smooth. I, like I say, I think. That went down well. Lucky it was only half, eh, people? <sighs> Never mind. They are back on it, be alright now. Right, so this. Is a definite yes. Yes, all day long. Um, That's one of the. Best pale owls I've had for a long time. 
I'm gonna give this um, a pretty good eight point five. Yeah, I could go along with that. Maybe, maybe even touching the nine. That we've only had, as you see, a half there. We will delve into this later. And um, yeah. The funny thing is, I did that one before the Hertog review we got to do because I thought, oh. yeah, we've done mm -hmm. it the wrong way around. We kind of had the best one first, I would believe, on this yeah. occasion. It does happen even to the best of us people, but there you go. Right, thanks for watching. We're both on a yes, and seriously, it's on Beer Wolf's website. I did check it, it's limited. I would definitely advise it if you use your powers, your IPAs, and everything. And your fruity beers, you can absolutely love it. Yeah, definitely. There's no dodgy taste. I mean, we'll make sure we sample the rest of that. Indeed. Indeed. Later on our holiday come down. Yeah. Um, thanks for watching. If you get this far, as I always say, if you don't, I don't mind. And like, subscribe, and comment. Bonjour.